So how's it going? It's now the next morning. I had a great sleep to be honest. Um, but I woke up and I'm still really tired. I've kind of flattened out again now. That bloat belly is gone and I'm ready to get some more carbs in. So my first six meals are just all going to be white potatoes. So all of that white potato is getting me for six meals. And the water is there. Six and a half litres today. Going to be fun times. I'm just here outside Westside Gym in Blanche in what is probably the hottest day in the year. I'm here to see Will Donahue. Um, he's a physiotherapist, neuromuscular specialist. So I'm going to get a lymphatic drainage done on my quads and maybe also just sort out some little muscular imbalances. We'll see. I'll try get some of it on film. So just finish up with Will, it was absolutely great session, um, I'm really tired after it because I was just lying down a lot, but yeah we found that one of my lats needed to come out so we worked on that, and one of my shoulders was lifting so we worked on that, and then we done some lymphatic drainage of the quads, so yeah, it's definitely going to help, I can't wait to see how... Um, it affects my body when I'm allowed to tense my legs. I'll be allowed to tense my legs tomorrow and I'll I'll see how my legs are looking and I'll show you then. Also it's time to get another potato meal in, so I'm gonna get that in now. Have all my potatoes with me in my bag and I'm absolutely starving. So it's now about six o'clock. I've had six meals and I'm about to move on to meal number seven. The white potato is done and it's just on to sweet potato now. Have a bit of a headache as well. Really warm day from the dehydrators, so that's what we have. Just a bowl of sweet potato. Okay, so it's about eight o'clock on the Thursday, and now it has come to probably my least favorite practice to do with these shows, and it's the shaving. So, for those of you who don't know, for a bodybuilding show, you have to be completely hairless, so removing hair from everywhere all over my body. Let's get to work. So I'm just about to sit down to my last meal, meal number 13 for the day. And it is very simply just a bit of chicken, a bit of spinach. So um, today went down pretty well. It was easy enough to get the food in. Still feeling a bit bloated and all. The hardest part of today was just shaving, but that took about two hours and it was just exhausting getting everywhere but sure that's what you have to do and yeah catch you tomorrow for day three so here we are day three had a great sleep again um just slept and slept and slept i guess this all being off work thing has its advantages not having to get up at a specific time and um, yeah really nice kind of smooth sleep and now i'm not flat i'm not really full the bloat's gone down not too bad, so one more day of um, kind of a medium carby kind of day today. So my first meal is a bowl of sweet potatoes. I know it's a rise of rice, what's new. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna go through my day. I have to get some tan on today as well. Maybe, you know, trim the beard a little bit. Look a bit purdy. So yeah, that's it. Okay guys, so I'm just about to put some tan on. You can see in my nice milk bottle shade right now so i'm going to use about two or three coats and we'll see what it looks like afterwards okay so that's two coats done of dark as tan and i am feeling uh, fairly dark to say the least so guys i'm just going through some meal prep for tomorrow that big bowl is actually breakfast the slightly smaller the slightly bigger lunchbox is to have about two hours later and then the other ones are just throughout the day Bit of white potato there, grapes, stuff like that. So that should do me uh, for the pre-judging and it should do me all the way up to the night show. And then what I have is I have in this bag 
a load of goodies that I'm not allowed to have yet, but I can't wait to have them. So, I'm a big LucasAid fan. LucasAid Orange, gotta be there. Then I have the Body First, Nutter Butter. I've literally been craving this since they came out with it. I've got some Reese's. If I can get to them. Oh, I've also got some Tesco free pastilles. If you're not on that Tesco poverty jelly life, get on it. Really good value, tastes nicer than the real thing. Protein bars. I actually have a selection. Uh, the Bear Bells, haven't tried them yet, but heard really, really good things. Got some Grenade, Neutromino, Lean. Cake Bites again, haven't had a chance to try them yet. Nice Oh Yeah bar, some Fulfill, and some more Bear Bells. And then I have some Reese's pieces as well. Obviously, I won't get through all of that tomorrow, but it's nice to just have it there and kind of choose what I want after stage. So yeah, um, I'm gonna have my last meal now, which is just some almonds and a turkey burger. And I'm gonna hit the bed, hopefully get some nice sleep, rest the feet up. See you in the morning. Good morning guys, today is finally here. Um, I don't know if you can notice, but if you look at my forehead, if you look about here, I don't know what I was doing to my face last night. Maybe had my elbow up against it or something like that. Um, <laughs> it looks pretty funny anyway, but look. How tanned I am. It's actually ridiculous how dark two coats of that stuff has made me. So yeah, um, pretty happy. Nice and full, nice and lean. Bit more filling out to do, so some more meals to get in this morning. The sun has gone for today, which I'm actually happy enough about because you know I'm gonna be indoors, so wouldn't wanna waste another sunny day. So yeah, about two hour drive. Gonna collect my friend Jean now, and we're gonna have some food first. Get collect my friend Jean and get going. Food's done. Gotta go. Just here in Belfast. Just have the car behind me and Jean. Wave to the camera, Jean. So basically, it was like twelve pounds fifty or something like that for six hours parking beside the venue. Twenty five pound for the day. So we found this nice estate. You can see all the cars parked all the way here. Um, but you know, you know you're in Northern Ireland when you're in the state and you see the big Celtic mural. i just going into registration now, so catch you soon. So guys, just here at registration, just registered. It's actually really small numbers in the show today. There's only like 27 competitors. I think there's like eight in the men's open class. I think it's just open. I don't think they're dividing it into lights, middles and heavies, but we'll wait and see. So pre judging should only take like an hour. I'd say, um, which is easily the smallest show I've ever been in. Like my class in Limerick a few weeks ago itself had 43 competitors in just one class, but sure look, um, we're here to promote, promote uh, natural bodybuilding in Ireland, so we're all here doing our best. Just had third meal, which was just a tiny little bit of sweet potato, a little bit of turkey from Kerrigan's. Kerrigan's keeps me going. And yeah, gonna go backstage shortly, put some tan on my face. It's not quite gonna be this color, but it's gonna be nice and pretty. And then gonna have some fun. So guys, I'm just here at Tour in Belfast. Uh, Pre-judging is done with, and I'm sporting that raccoon look of tan. I think it looks quite fashionable, you know yourself. So yeah, pre-judging went really well. It was a stacked class, and there was only four in my category, but it was really tough. They worked us hard. Um, I, I don't know, like people have been saying kind of probably I got second because the guy who probably got first is in absolutely unreal condition. Um, but it's tough one for me between second and third. We'll just see if they're going for kind of more condition or more size, I don't really know. But I'm really, really happy with what I brought anyway. Unfortunately, um, it's not on uh, quality film. My only mission really was to find some nice treats for afterwards. I went into Lidl, they didn't really have anything. I went into Dunn's and they didn't have much and there was a few things I was looking for. I was looking for some ice cream pies, which I didn't actually get. So if anyone wants to send me some of those, like cream pies, sponsored athlete or something, I'm not going to turn it down. But what I did get was I got some walnut whips, which I absolutely love. I got some paprika flavoured Pringles, which I haven't had in ages. I'm not even sure if you can get them in the Republic. Really not sure. And the one thing I was looking for that I got in Poundland just behind me is a Muju. I have not had Muju all year and I am 
a big fan of Muju. Like again, Muju, if you want to sponsor me, it's okay, it's fine. And what else? I also got some Twinkies, which I've never had in my life, so I was just kind of a bit curious. So yeah, anyway, gonna head back to the venue now, and it's a night show, so I get to do my routine. Hopefully you get to see it, and then just have a bit of fun, and then it's awards. So, catch you soon.
So guys, just finished up here at the BMBF uh, qualifier in Belfast. So I came away with third place and a British final here, boys. So I'm delighted with that. And now, what we're going to get to do is I'm a Luxe all year. And we're going to see every week if I can drink this. Guys, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the show. I hope you see what uh, natural body do. Or, well, you didn't because you didn't get to film, but anyway, hopefully, my routine's on there anyway. Thanks for uh, following the journey. Uh, Support the channel. Really, really appreciate it. Leave a comment if you have any suggestions of what you want to see. Uh, like, uh, don't, give it a share if you want, and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks very much.